Hello everybody, it's Reverend Chris Wilson and here to talk to you about worship at St. Andrew this week and in particular the sermon. We've been uh, in the middle of the series entitled Why. And we've looked at why religion and why questions and why Jesus and, and the, the focus for this week is why church. Uh, one of the things that's a growing trend in our country is we have more people that believe in God or have a spirituality but people are less inclined to be a part of an organized religious experience. And we see this growing trend. And so why would we even choose church? Um, can I just believe in Jesus at home? Isn't that good enough? And the sermon this week will reflect on the nature of, of why the value would be increased in our life by being a part of a church community. Uh, Paul writes in the letter to Romans in chapter 12 some of, the, some of the characteristics or traits that are valuable when it comes to people that are drawn toward the same belief structure when they're together, the value of them being together. Um, yes, the church has done its fair job of harming people and doing injustice to people, but the church has also been a place, and I hope St. Andrew has been a place that exhibits uh, kind of a radical love, a wide open welcome, and a unique way to be church in the world, and that we find value in being connected to one another and not allowing our faith to be the solo, isolated experience. There's something about being in community and connection with others that adds value to my faith. So we'll, we'll look at why church and how that church experience uh, makes maybe a bigger impact on you than you think it does. And that can be whether you're experiencing church in person, you're experiencing church online, if you're uh, doing the live stream on Sunday morning, there's something about being interconnected and interwoven with other people's lives and doing that together that brings added value. So I hope you join us as we explore the church question this week.